So you want Minecraft to run silky smooth like this? Well, I'll tell you what. Stay tuned and find out how right after this intro of awesomeness. <laughs> Yo, what's going on guys and girls, it's Story here, and welcome to a tutorial on how to increase your FPS in Minecraft. I know a lot of you have been, you know, asking for tips on all this, so I'm going to go ahead and give it to you. But anyways, I don't want to waste your time on the intro, let's go ahead and get right into the tips. And we're going to start out pretty simple here with the most basic one, and that tip is F3. Now obviously, a lot of you probably know this tip, so take it with a grain of salt. F3 is how you check your FPS. And that way, whenever you do these things, these tips, you can see how much of an increase you get in your frames per second. Now with that said, let's go ahead and move on to the next tip. And we're going to start out really simple here with the stuff you can do in-game without having to go you know, out of the game into settings and whatnot. So let's start out very simple here and just head on into our options. Now most of you, of course, have tried this before, but we got to start simple. So you can go into your video settings and change your graphics. From fancy to fast that's gonna actually give you a huge boost and your smooth lighting pretty much the same thing you can turn it off and you'll get a, a pretty significant uh, FPS boost so in your settings you'll find a whole bunch of things you can go through here tinker them around change your render distance bring it down like that and that'll make a big difference alright enough with the actual game side let's move to the desktop where you can see some really big increases okay guys so here we are on the desktop uh, Pretty much these actual tweaks to the game are going to make a huge difference, uh, much more than the in-game stuff. So anyways, let's start off with one of the biggest tips here. Now this does depend on your actual computer slightly, uh, but you know, depending on how much RAM you have, it's going to affect the, the performance boost you get here. So go ahead and open up Minecraft and click on Edit Profile, and down here you're going to see this area called JVM Arguments. For you, it most likely will be unchecked like that. So just go ahead and check it. Uh, and right here, you can see what I have typed. It's, I'll have it down in the uh, description below so you can check it out. But anyways, what you want to do to find out what number you're going to put there is you want to go ahead and head into your system. So you can just search for system or go to your control panel and find system. It's pretty simple. It's easy to find. And in there, you'll see how much RAM you have. For me, I have 16 gigabytes, and I highly doubt you'll have that. You'll probably have something more like 4, maybe 3 probably four that's that's the average I guess you could say so anyways depending on how much you have you wanna change this number to be a little bit less so uh, if you have four gigs of RAM you could go for two gigs so usually my rule of thumb is to leave two gigabytes of RAM to spare so uh, so if you had four just do two gigs now if you had a bigger number you can increase this number here if you had six you could do a four and maybe if you had 16 like I had you can do 12 or 14 really just increase that number as much as you can just make sure you leave at least two gigabytes of RAM alright so moving on to the next tip now, this tips are really simple and anyone can do it in just a matter of seconds all you have to do is just make sure your minecraft's in windowed mode so go to options other uh, and make sure you put it in full screen to off so you're actually playing in a window uh, with a window you can go to the top corner or, or any corner and drag to make it bigger or smaller now what this does it's basically the smaller you make the window, the easier Minecraft will run. So you'll get you'll get a better frames per second. And if you make the window bigger, you'll get a worse frames per second. So this tip is you know definitely useful. I wouldn't recommend playing in a very small window because then you can't really see what's going on. Uh, but if you really have to, it's an option that's available to you. All right. So moving on to the next tip, what you want to do is go ahead and hit Control Shift Escape on your keyboard. Now hitting that's going to go ahead and open up your Task Manager which shows you basically all the processes going on with your computer. After that, go ahead and open up Minecraft and let it load. So this tip, what we're going to do is we're going to allocate a little more processing power to Minecraft. So to do this, you just want to go ahead and head over to your actual, not here, to your details tab, and then right click on the, uh, the one called Java. Now, it won't be called Minecraft, it'll be called just Java, this one right here. So right click on that and go to set priority and by default it's on normal so all you want to do is just go ahead and increase it maybe put it on high I wouldn't put it on real time just put it on high and you're good to go alright so last but not least is Optifine now Optifine is probably the one of the best tips in this entire video I saved it for last 
because it for some people it can increase your your frames per second by over 200 frames. That's that's a pretty big increase. So just go ahead and go to Optifine and go to the downloads page. Find the version you're running. If it's the most recent, it'll be the one at the top. And download. I usually do Ultra, and then I download the the newest one or the one all the way at the top. So I download, and then I'm just gonna put it on my desktop. This, this is very simple. It takes no time at all. It's not difficult. So here it is on my desktop. All you have to do, left click it, and just click install. And that's literally all it does. And boom, you're done. So if you went ahead and did all of these tips. Uh, as I did in the video, you should see a massive increase in your performance in Minecraft. Uh, if you didn't, you can leave a comment down below and let me know and I'll try to help you out. But if you actually followed all these perfectly, Optifine and all of that, uh, it should help you out quite a bit. You might be going from 30 frames or 20 frames a second all the way up to 100 or 200. So anyways guys, that's the video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please click like and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.